YouTube was popping. You know, we've been following the DG and Dub and Britney situation. You know what I'm saying with Tawana. So we're gonna continue that. You know, with a little bit of mix. So the video was DDG, other sis, fallout with Britney. You know what I'm saying? The other sis is TT. Ruby Rose excited. Haley Bailey speaks. I don't know if she speaks on, but we're going to find out. All right. It's the boy 41 pop. Um, make sure you like and subscribe. Let's get into it. Well, well, well. Looks like Speed has a new girlfriend, a new couple for you guys to ship together. Here okay. they are celebrating her birthday. Absolutely no way. Absolutely no way. <laughs> we got a girl, that's wild. Birthday. Boy smell like hot shit, I heard. Like he smelled bad. So cute. I still ain't see her face yet. On this lovely Sunday. W R W speed W speed. Two C and Asian dog going at it on Twitter. It started because Lucy, Asian dog, do you think? Where I been at? Tusi made a video saying, how do females get famous just by dating a rapper or having a baby by a rapper? Like, he feels like that's an issue. Not realizing that his girlfriend is famous for dating him. So, this is what he said, y'all. When the fuck did being somebody girlfriend make you famous? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me see. Let me read that. My son, mom, living in a seven bedroom house and then driving a quarter million dollar car and don't have to work a day if she don't want to. And I take care of all of it. Stop trying to paint this weird ass narrative that I'm hating on her when I was speaking generally. Social media weird. Okay, never seen BD shade they be so damn, bruh. Okay. He said, y'all. When the fuck did being somebody girlfriend make you famous? When the fuck was that ever a celebrity? You could go on famous birthdays now and you won't fuck being celebrities and you don't even know what the fuck they do. They just somebody girlfriend or fucking baby mom. It is crazy. They don't got a product they selling. They don't do nothing. They don't got nothing going on. They just famous because the world done blew them up. It is crazy. Like... You actually had to put in work to be a celebrity back in the days. The internet is blowing people up. I be seeing with 7 million followers. I don't know what she do. <laughs> I be seeing, and, and, and it's really, it's, it's not even like the for real, because it's really, it's the, I'm going to tell you what it is. You got it's a point, though. That shit funny. Okay, that got all these girls blowing up. You feel me? <laughs> do you need no. Nah, it's true, though. It's true, 100%. I, no, I ain't talk about nobody. <laughs> okay, so Lucy and Asian Don engaged in that heated exchange after she accuses him of hating on the mother of his child, Samara J. You literally went and got your high school crush pregnant, which was cute, regular girl who did lashes. You showed her off to the platform of millions of fans, put her in a music video, brought her on stage while you performed to her, and now you mad she got famous. Niggas is weird and haters. Hey, yo. <laughs> Wait, is he mad though? That's the problem. Watch, watch who y'all date, cause niggas be so mad when you come up. I want you to stay down for this. <laughs> hey, yo. Hey, yo, the In beef the world, is real. The real. We got so many niggas that got so many songs talking about how they giving hoes money, how ho they ain't, they <laughs> up about they bitch, how they love they. And we got Tusi that get on the internet every day and talk about how girls not shit and they just got a nigga to get some money and they can get a name. They can be somebody baby mama. Wait, wait, and, wait, wait. What, what, what have Asia Doll done? What have Asia Doll done for real, for real though? Like, <laughs> why is she famous? Like, <laughs> nah, I'm gay. Why is she famous? What she do? Can get a name. They can be somebody baby mama. I say this Asian got a point, but she's not one to speak because bro, she fighting for for fame right now. <laughs> she fighting to hold on to that fame, bro. She link in with I, I hey you know what? This is part of it too. She has to defend Samira because Samira got clout. She don't got King Vaughn no more. King Vaughn was her clout. She don't got that. 
So she make a point, but she also is the point. You know what I'm saying? And they can get a name. When we got out here that's really putting hoes on, really putting bitches in position, really, you know what I'm saying, really turning that bitch up. And we got bitches like Tussie. Well, you you just said he put her in his music video. He put her on stage. He put her in damn near everything that he done. So he's probably not talking about her specifically. He's probably talking about the other ones that don't do nothing. That literally don't do nothing. Probably just do OnlyFans. It's freaky AO. It's a lot of Diddy. Yo. You think Diddy's the only one, bro? Look next to you. That motherfucker is a Diddy. Get your song you punk ass nigga my mama your ass up bitch i'ma keep saying it that's <laughs> some boy and you played with the right one you should have just let me say what i was gonna say and keep it pushing oh god we got all these rappers talking all right about at the end of the day this is, this is funny though about how they turning up how they <laughs> hilarious don't about stuff big ass, how they don't do about this and that help me all type of shit. then we got this pup this punk ass over here with these tight ass leather mm -hmm. pants on with these long boots but now, if we scroll down the comment section, you can see people saying that, hey, you're talking about your girlfriend. And he actually commented and said that he is not talking about his girlfriend. I just be wondering how y'all be sitting when y'all mm -hmm. come up with some of these dumb theories. Crisscross applesauce. Nah, oh, and continue to go at Asian doll. Where well, my son, like, this is what I be talking about, about the celebrity. I never really cared to be famous. I ain't even gonna hold y'all. Like, I did it. I been that before. I get this shit. Yo, listen, let me tell you something. Asian doll, you fucking bad body, electric toothbrush, botched body built. I don't even know how to you speaking on my relationship you can't even nah that was random though why did she just hop in there like that like why did she do that that's mad random bro even keep a dick inside of you you go from dick to fucking dick. have you found it yet fuck like and i really a violate because i know some shit about you but like bro i ain't gonna lie we all know about asian dog people in denial bro asian dog done fucked half the industry dog and she repping King Vaughn, talking about, oh, I, I speak to his ghost. Hey, yo, y'all keep, y'all keep, y'all put niggas, niggas could say one thing, right? One thing, y'all put them to the dirt. The girl, bruh, she could say she even spoke to the devil, bruh. And y'all somehow, she'd be like, oh, I was just playing or I was doing, y'all would take that back. <laughs> I'm like, are you good? You good, honey? You good? What? <laughs> Hell nah. Hell nah, but you know what it is. Y'all freaky ass. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out why you speaking on a real like shit like you. I think y'all be getting me misconstrued for one of these peons. I never been there. Like stop fing playing with me. You. Realistically, oh Tushi shouldn't even say nothing to her, bro. He shouldn't even have responded back to her, bro. He got his album coming. He needs to focus. He shouldn't even have said nothing about this whole situation because you know how the internet is. Realistically, he should just mind his goddamn business. It is what it is, bro. You ain't you speaking about it ain't gonna stop. It ain't gonna stop. It's gonna happen, bro. There's plenty of diddlers out here, my boy, and they are willing to pay five five ninety nine and never even touch the ponani. Trust me, man. Don't even say nothing about it. Nasty. Because you talking about you really built like an infected tooth. Come on. Nah, don't delete your. Bro, Asian dog been making bread off that OnlyFans. She been chilling. She been chilling. The tweets. I, I got a few questions for you because I, I just seen you. First off, Hero 2 see you gay in this story. <laughs> hey, yo, you cannot argue. Hey, yo, don't argue with her, bro. She's a child. You cannot argue with a child and he, her whole fan base is full of kids. So don't argue with her. One, I seen you bring up the gay shit. We already know that's what throw at a black man every time she get mad. Like we we know that. Fuck, you don't got no receipts, no nothing. I'll buy you out of your deal. If you even still got a deal, I'll buy you out of you your deal. You know what's funny, bro? He could have he 
I'm pretty sure he was probably talking about a whole white woman. Probably even talking about a black lady. He was probably talking about a whole white woman. Or or Puerto Rican or Mexican. He probably wouldn't even talk about no black lady, but she's so quick to jump. It's crazy. Deal right now if you got some two uh some proof. Two, I got a question. Why the fuck is one of your titties bigger than the other? Like I'm <laughs> confused by that. Did you go inside of the doctor and ask for a D in a C cup? Or did you just go ask for the same size titties and he fucked you up? Which one was it? From her on now, we're going to let Tusi make it, man. He fighting demons. The demons is his sexuality. Let's talk about Ruby real quick. Because <laughs> she said she's outside. I'm going outside tonight. Hey, yo, Ruby been outside. What the fuck? Why are you telling us you outside? You've been outside. We know you've been outside. You've been outside forever. This is one lady, if we sh if she ever settles down, we'll be shocked. No bullshit. This is like, literally, like, if she ever settles down, we'll be shocked. Morals on zero. No morals. Zero. Going outside tonight. The comments are saying they never stop talking. Exactly. Y'all assume too much. What you mean they both said it before? I know that's why Ruby, she getting her man back. To be honest, I don't think she wants that man no more. You talking about DDG? You talking about DDG? Her ego, but as a woman, no, nah, I refuse to believe she want him after he had a whole baby. She oh, should have always shit. had him about back if she wanted. She was going out because it was her birthday, but he did. I think DDG smarter than that. She for the... Nah. He say he's going to be in Miami for his birthday. That's a whole mess you don't want, bro. That's a whole mess you don't want, especially when she's so easily bought. You got too many haters that's willing to spend that bag just to get at you, and they'll probably make a video about it just to get the bag back, so... You know what I'm saying? Nah. nah. And she lives there, so we'll see. The job PP posted their breakup on her birthday. What if he been watching her? Um, it wasn't her birthday. It was the day after. Yeah, I don't think it was on her birthday. It was on Hallie's brother's birthday. It's literally her birthday weekend. He's definitely her favorite ex. McQueen was recently on a podcast and he spoke about the falling out with him and DDG. Now, of course, this was years ago, but the question was brought up again. And this is what he said. But the problem where I f it was I put it in the thumbnail. Oh, yeah, you went crazy. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And at the time, I was just thinking about the money. You right, know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, but yeah, I wasn't. Go. Oh, you know what saying? And, and I wasn't right. thinking about, okay, damn, like. It's your dog. Yes, my, that's my homie. But I, I, right. in my mind, I'm like, that's still my homie. I just didn't yeah. think on his that's that's some real shit he was just thinking about. He's being real. As long as he's not being fake. You know what I'm saying? Everybody make mistakes and shit and not thinking like this YouTube shit really go kinda too far sometimes. So like I could see it. I could see it. But as long as you being real and you own up to it, bro, and you see your mistake, you can do better. Perspective. Nobody's right. perfect. And so I can understand how that hurt his feelings. You right. know what I'm saying? Now looking back. But so that's what kind of like pissed him off. Right. You know what I'm saying? And then, you know, uh, but I I realized what happened and how it made him feel like, I think like six, seven months to a year later. And I just went up to his crib and I just ch chopped it up. With him and I told him like, hey, bro, you know what I'm saying? I don't even care if we become homies again. I just want to let you know that's real. that, you know, I, I didn't understand your perspective before. And now I do. And I'm sorry for that. And I genuinely apologize. <clears throat> and then, you know what I'm saying? I just left it at that. Right. Now, I know this situation is old, 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 but I'm going to give a little backstory for the new people that's here. DDG dated Kennedy Simone at one point. They broke up. His friend McQueen and Kennedy and some other people was in Miami, and DDG was not in Miami, I believe. McQueen was filming a YouTube video. Kennedy was there at the beach with everybody else, and she kept getting in the video flirting with McQueen to make DDG mad. In the video oh. that I showed y'all, McQueen is acknowledging that what he did wrong. Hey, yo, I wasn't watching around that time, but you can't mess with somebody like that. You can't mess with somebody like that, dog. You know, in the comments talking about you miss him and McQueen. You see, I got problems. 
yeah, that see. day was put her, he put Kennedy in his thumbnail. Now McQueen and DDG are cool. They made up, for those of you who are wondering, DDG recently addressed the breakup on his podcast. He said him and Hallie are still family, forever will be family. Nobody was wrong in the situation. They're just taking a little break. Mm -hmm. And you don't know what the future could hold. So they might get back together. Right. Let me see my new grand. They got a whole kid. What you expect? You know what I'm saying? Before I let y'all go, take a look at this interview that Hallie did. Now, it seems like this could have been after the breakup. And, uh... DDG has taken the internet by storm because we're so just, I don't know about you, I wrote about this. He, it's so refreshing to see him so engaged as a father. Um, I, I think it's so heartwarming. Uh, and I love seeing your son on TikTok. I wanted to know, like, is this how you envisioned DDG to be a father? Oh, yeah. I mean, he's a great dad, but I always knew that he would be like this, you know, <laughs> we had talked about it. Um, and yeah, that's just the type of person he is. So Halo is is really, really lucky. Yes, he's surrounded by love, it shows. It really I'm does. Dead. Okay, so they are jumping TT, DDG's little sister, in these comments on TikTok. Why are they jumping poor TT, bro? Why are y'all so evil, bro? What's she do to you, bro? Y'all love to jump somebody. I love drama, huh? What's she do? Talk. So TT pranked Britney. Noticing how y'all are together, and you know y'all really good with Wuab. I'll give you that. Y'all, y'all raised a, a nice child. He's bad, <laughs> but he's nice. You know what I'm saying? He's. What you call him bad? He is. So TT been fake to what, Mama, all this time? Is, but he's smart. Like he's very he's not intelligent. Yes, but um, I just don't feel like you're the white, the right girl for my brother. I feel like you're the, you're the right baby mama, but Ooh. not the right girl. I mean, it really don't matter how you feel. <laughs> how? Is this a prank? You just, you just I'm the sister. It should matter how I feel. But you're not dating me, so. But I mean, I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. But if Aerie's sister says she don't like you, would you go break up with her? If she's giving me a good reason, you haven't even let me get to the good reason yet. Who cares if the sister like you or not? What do you mean? I'm not you... sleeping with you. I think it was a prank. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm saying that I don't feel like y'all are like perfect together. I feel like he deserves someone better. Oh. Who better call than me? The prank. There's someone out there. Nah. I put the B in better. Brittany. Better. See, I don't think he needs that type of corniness. Terrible. I don't know. Yeah, these comments are so bad that TT herself. They'll be a good Sally. So I didn't see no TT was like, I think this was a prank. It was a prank, bro. And realistically, bro, um, Brittany loved Dub, bro. It is what it is. Y'all just mad. Y'all want to be them so bad. Get over it. Y'all not. Uh, the fuck over it, man. Saw this clip on TikTok and she had to let the people know, hey, it was a prank. Get off my back. Get off my neck. Get off my feet. She said it was a prank. Y'all take anything and run with it. That's a fact. And of course, people do not believe her. They say no. Nah, nah, that was really no prank. <laughs> people only cover up how they really the joke. Hey, yo, these, yo, evil, bro. <laughs> Evil, 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 evil. Remember these names, bro. Evil, evil, evil. That's the names, bro. No, nah, that was real. Ain't no prank. Yawn emoji. <laughs> yeah, and now they fall out. Hmm. People always cover up how they really feel as a joke. Oh, yeah. So under this video, TT had posted that her and Brittany fell out over their own personal issues or personal reasons. But I don't see it on this anymore. But I do have a screenshot of it. Somebody says, see, families like this irritate me. Family and relationships don't mix. What? Something wrong with her. And she got 3,000 likes on that shit, bro. Something wrong with a lot of people, bro. So you supposed to just be in your relationship and then not 
not have a family, not have a relationship with your your family. I don't know. I think I think family and relationships can mix. Brittany really tries so hard to be nice to her. I'm so glad Britt is no longer around his family. And These are people that's going to, they're going to push her to be on her own and then just abandon her. For real, for real. Gonna be in her. Doing her own thing. This is so wrong and it's not her place to say that. Deb is the not devil moves in mysterious ways. These boobers, these, these cob is like a mother. God damn. Guys, so like, I'm just going to scroll through some of these comments. And add some background music Yo. or something like that. Evil's head. 